Today I'm going to show you how to make this gorgeous looking wooden desk lamp using simple hand tools. For material I used two solid wood boards, one board 3 cm wide and thick and another board 1 cm wide and thick. To create the lamp shade I used a piece of paper and a linen fabric. I also need a light bulb, a socket and a cord. So let's get started. First I marked all the dimensions needed for the lamp base. Then I cut the board using a handsaw. You can find the exact dimensions down in the video description. Next I am sanding the edges of the pieces that I've cut to make them even, so it would be easier to work with the glue. To get the desired shape I glued all the pieces of wood together using a wood glue, a square ruler and some clamps. You need a lot of patience because you can't glue all at once, but it's definitely worth the time. Before gluing the last piece of wood I marked the center point of the lampshade and drilled a hole for the cord 4.5 cm deep using 6 mm bit. I extended the hole from the back side of the same piece of wood at a 45 degree angle so it would be much easier for the cord to pass through. Then I glued up this last piece of the lamp base. Now let's move on to the lampshade frame. I marked the dimensions of the second board. I made a cuboid frame 20 cm high and 15 cm wide, so I cut 4 pieces 20 cm long and 8 pieces 13 cm long. The last and most important piece of wood is the frame support with size 5 by 13 cm. I used a 30 mm bit to countersink a hole 1 cm deep. Then I used 6 mm bit to drill a hole all the way through so that it perfectly matched the center of the base. The next step is building the cuboid frame. I glued all the pieces together and used square ruler along with the clamps to make a perfect right angle. To make everything nice and level I'm going to hit with 120 grit sandpaper which should make a quick work of all the unevenness. Then I finished it off with a spray paint. I painted both the base and the frame with a chocolate brown spray paint because I wanted to create more contrast between them and the lampshade. I applied two coats of spray paint and left it to dry out. After that I moved on to making the lampshade. I used a paper roll and cut 62 by 21 cm of it. I also cut the linen fabric 63 by 23 cm so that I could easily glue it to the paper and fold the edges to get nice and smooth look. It took me some time until I finished gluing the fabric to the paper because I wanted to make sure everything was lined up. I decided to use a wood glue and it actually turned out quite well. The glue wasn't drying too fast, so I had some time to adjust the fabric to the paper with a ruler. I glued up the lamp shade to the frame. It is very important to do this carefully, one side at a time, because you need to align the edges of the frame with the edges of the shade. I folded the fabric on the top of the frame to get the desired look, but you can skip this step simply by cutting the paper 20 cm wide at the beginning. Now I can finally put all the pieces together. I'm mixing up some 5 minute epoxy to stick the socket. 
I made sure everything was lined up and then used wood glue to stick the lamp shade to the base. I held it with finger pressure for only a few minutes until the glue started to harden. I suggest you use LED light bulb because it produces a very small and significant amount of heat. This is the final result and I ended up really liking it. Thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you want more DIY projects like this every week.